Catalog management is arguably one of the most important aspects of launching a web store. In most of the cases, when a user visits any web store, the first thing that he or she is doing browses the catalog. To create the catalog for your web store, Sana uses Item Master data in SAP Business One. Using the checkbox Visible in Web Store, you can show and hide any item in the web store. You can also block any item from purchasing by making it inactive, or enter the range of dates to determine the validity period of the item. If the item is marked as visible but it is inactive, it will be shown in the Sana Web Store, but customers will not be able to purchase it. Inactive items are shown as not available in the Web Store. In SAP Business One, item name can be entered in different languages and shown in the Sana Web Store if it is multilingual. On the Remarks tab, you can add item description, which will be shown on the Product Details page in the Sana Web Store. Item description can be also added in different languages. The base unit price can be set in the general area of the item master data, but item prices in SAP Business One are usually defined in various price lists. So here you can assign the item to a certain price list. In SAP Business One, you can group items which share certain characteristics, for example, electronics or women's clothing. Here, you can assign the item to the appropriate item group. Item groups with the assigned items can be imported to Sana to automatically build web store navigation and catalog. Sana supports multiple units of measure, meaning that a customer can select a unit of measure for an item in the web store. In SAP Business One, an item can be assigned to a certain unit of measure group, and here you can set up the default sales unit of measure. Well, this is only the basics. Watch other video tutorials in our video gallery to learn everything you need to know about catalog management in SAP Business One. For example, there is a nice feature in the Sana Dawn Catalog Overview which simulates the web store behavior and where a user can see an overview of all item prices, stock, last modified date of an item, item's orderability and visibility, and even manage visibility of items.